NASA has decided to end one of its crucial missions. After months of trying to salvage its lunar CubeSat, NASA is calling an end to its water hunting mission. The organization is finally giving up on its tiny water hunting CubeSat, officially named the Lunar Flashlight, after failing to fix its propulsion issues. NASA engineers had until the end of April to generate the thrust required to conduct monthly flybys of the Lunar South Pole. Lunar Flashlight's miniaturized propulsion system was the first of its kind to be flown beyond Earth's orbit as a demonstration of a new technology. It was highly successful from the standpoint of being a test bed for new systems that had never flown in space before. The briefcase-sized satellite was launched in December 2022 on a mission to shine infrared light on some of the moon's permanently shadowed areas, scanning the lunar south pole for ice water reservoirs. Shortly after launch, however, the CubeSat began experiencing problems with its propulsion system. Three of the lunar flashlight's four thrusters were underperforming due to obstructed fuel lines, most likely due to debris buildup. The CubeSat was supposed to enter a rectilinear halo orbit around the moon using its sole functioning thruster, but even that had began experiencing its own issues. So NASA hatched a plan to place the probe in a high Earth orbit, allowing it to scan the moon's south polar regions once per month as opposed to once per week with its original orbit. For the past five months, mission teams had been trying to resolve lunar flashlight's propulsion issues to get it on its modified track. NASA engineers had been trying to clear suspected obstructions in the thruster fuel lines, enabling the spacecraft to produce adequate thrust for carrying out monthly flybys of the Moon's South Pole region. Lunar flashlight had also carried a new Sphinx flight computer, a radiation-hardened, low-power system developed by NASA's Jet Propulsion Laboratory. Also aboard was IRIS, an upgraded navigation radio to rendezvous and land on the moon. Subscribe to One India channel and never miss an update.